Yep. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my god. Those are all fish eggs. So I took out the filter and there was like just lots and lots of uh, fish eggs inside. So I think there I still missed some there inside there. I, I put the filter inside and put an air pump inside, you know, to circulate the the water. So they said you can see fish fry within 12 to 36 hours. Uh, this is this is super super unexpected. I don't know what to say about these guys. They just you know. Good job. I can see hatched fish. That's one of it there. Wait, wait, I show you wait, huh? Uh yeah, can wait uh, let me see where the camera can focus now. Do you see those things? Yeah, there in the middle, right in the middle. Yeah, that thing, that's a fish. Where else? That's one more fish. Where uh, there here there's one fish there. One more fish inside here. Now I found out that they don't move very much when they are like uh, young. Day one, I decided to take out all the baby fishes from the bucket using a spoon. It was quite tough, but as you can see, we we were doing it little by little and we managed. I put in some floating pellets, as you can see in the video, and uh, it seems that one of it was actually trying to eat it so I made a egg yolk mixed with water now I did I did see them eat but I missed it on camera so I'm gonna try and pour a little bit more inside you know and try to just focus on the white spots and you can see them coming after it Day 2, I used a very fine net picked them all out transferred them to a different container and then cleaned up their basin after that, I put them all back inside and fed them some egg yolk Day 3, I got Kutu Ae, also known as water fleas. They are microscopic, so it's the food to give for baby fish. I added some light plants so that the fishes can go and uh, hide in them, get some hide shelter, have a nice time growing up. Day 5, we can actually see the fishes moving around quite fast. We can see their eyes, their fins, uh, their mouths opening and closing, taking in air. So, yes, yeah, a lot of progress. I also noticed that uh, the bigger fishes are eating the smaller fishes. 
day seven we can see that uh, one of the fish is actually very big compared to the rest i'm sure that he's going to be a legend some of the water fleas actually sat on the leaf to escape getting eaten Alright guys, in the next video I'll show you how much they've grown the following week.